Hey guys, and welcome back to Overblood in the last episode. Uh, we found Millie, our friend here. Uh, unfortunately, Peepo's still dead, but we have his brain in our pocket. I mean, I'm guessing that's his brain. Uh, oh, apparently we've still got more oil container. I mean, we literally um, chuck this stuff on to the lift. You heard it. You hear it splash all over that thing. But apparently, we still have more oil. Um, we have our tape recorder, which actually, or voice recorder, I guess. I doubt they use tapes anymore, which might not be a terrible idea to put down a hard save thinking about it. Because we haven't done that for a while. Come on. I don't like fast forwarding um, when I'm doing anything involving saving. I have checked before and it doesn't seem to affect it, but I don't want to take the risks. And I don't want to rely on save states. Okay. Now, we have a little bit of a problem here, don't we? We have a car that's gonna flatten us. Uh... I literally oh that was close. The explosion must have jarred it into action. You were supposed to be careful with it. I'm sorry, but if we're gonna get out of this place, we've gotta take some risks. I can't imagine what caused all this destruction. Maybe yeah. a few too many guys like you taking risks. Ooh. Ooh. I hear that sass. Yeah, well, we've got to take some risks. Um, yeah, okay, I'm not sure how I actually ducked down and dived out the way. Uh, okay, cool. Last time we just got flattened, but hey. Right, what have we got here? Ooh, a handgun. Uh, yes, please. This will be useful. Yes, it will. We may encounter a monster again. Red key card. Ah, oh, we got the red key card. Can we even go back? Got the red key card. Is it worth going all the way back? I mean, I'm guessing we're going to find something useful. We got a handgun. Too high to climb over. Ah, shit. Ah, wait. Can you stop pushing thin air? Seriously, that's really fucking annoying. So this handgun, does it have an ammo limit? Oh, so it has three remaining bullets. Okay. Not sure why a 9mm handgun uh, was put into storage with only three bullets left. Interesting. Right, let's see if we can go all the way back to those storage lockers and use this red keycard. I'm going to be a little bit miffed if this is not what this keycard is for. Uh, i got to try and remember as well. Right, we... Yeah. Was it this way? Oh, God. We've got to remember our way bloody back now as well, haven't we? Uh, it was not that way. I don't know if monsters, like, randomly spawn or if they're... Um... You know, pre... Um, oh, can't open it from here. Okay, so we, we can't actually go back. I, mm, I have my doubts, but fine. Maybe we'll find another way into that area. So in that case, we got to go forwards. You can't always go back to go forwards. Sometimes you got to go forwards to go back. Yes. Okay, so we... Oh! Ah! Ah! Right, that gets us around that little uh, blockage, doesn't it? Uh, is there anything stuck down here? No. How that thing got twisted like that? Dude, that would have, you know, required a hell of a lot of force. But ours is not to question why. Stop flipping us off, dude. Seriously, it's not cute anymore. 
Okay, so what have we got going on in here then? Big, large, open, empty, white room. Oh, is the controller for the air duct valve? I don't know the password. Great. Wonderful. Perfect. Uh, there is a valve thing up here. Can we jump up? Wait, I can't climb up there. It's too high for me to reach. Sorry, Millie. We'll find another way to go. All right. Okay, that's fine. It's locked. Right, so the red card key was just for that door. That's easy enough. Right. To be fair, if we encounter... Oh, we've got decisions. If we encounter another monster... Surely lock from the other side. It's just better to kick its ass because that didn't seem that hard and the fight controls were way more Responsive than you would think they would be Oh, they're both in exactly the same pose. That's kind of cute actually This looks like some kind of clean room Looks like some kind of control room Yep, just flip off everybody in the audience. Smooth. Halt! You may not proceed beyond this point until sterilization is completed. Sterilization? As in decontaminated. Hmm, you sure? I may want to have kids someday. Really? Really? Yeah. Still, somebody should tell the computer that it's a little late to be worried about contamination. No <clears throat> kidding. Well, she found that fascinating. Does she want to have his babies? Some computers just don't get it. I wish this computer were more like Peepo. He understood. <laughs> Peepo. Peepo. What's a Peepo? My little robot friend. He helped me out of a jam, but he... He didn't survive. Oh, you met SR-19. I see. I mean... SR-19? What? Did you... Oh, no. Nothing. I, I, I was just... Never mind. He helped me when I was attacked by one of those mutants, but he died in the effort. So tell me about this... what did you call him? People, if you were still with us, we wouldn't have any trouble getting through here. We will just have to give it a try ourselves. Let's just do what the computer asks us to do. Get ourselves sterilized. Surely you'll get sterilized in this this room, ask, though. You think you can figure out how to initiate the sterilization sequence? I'd better. This is the end of the line. We're going to have to get access to the equipment first, right? I'll get in. One way or another. You better wait here. No, don't leave me, Raz. This will make you feel better. Even those things aren't immune to bullets. Oh, I guess I'll be all right. <laughs> Look out for yourself. I won't leave you alone. I give you my word. Ah, that was touching. That was absolutely um, <clears throat> beautiful. Perfect, even, you know. All right, smell you later. Okay, so she's got the piece, but she only has three rounds. I guess we can now jump into this hole. I mean, she's after Raz's babies pretty bad. I can already... Look, I can read the room, okay? There we go. So much for us having a gun. Oh, no. Yeah, right, let's... Just fast forward all this nonsense. Um... Oh, God, we've got choices, I think. Can't go any further. Ooh. What was that? Sounded like something just closed. Oh, God. This is going to be like a little puzzle, isn't it? Yeah, we heard something close. Okay. Okay. <laughs> 
Can we... Thank you. Oh, shit. I'm stuck. This won't open. I guess we're going to have to transfer back to Millie. I guess. <laughs> He's just standing there. Finger guns. And she's pushing thin air because... Uh, yes? Alright. I guess we're going to have to... Raz, I hope you're right. It's been too long. I'm going to find him. Uh, in a manner of speaking. Yeah, she's not actually going to go and find us. She's just going to go operate that computer. Oh, she doesn't have a password, though, does she? Fuck. Um, well, that's awkward. Um, right. Your password is valid. Enter right. your command. Wait. There. Oh, uh, silly fool. He's gotten himself stuck behind the ventilation turbo valve. What? That's all right, Raz. I'll have you out of there in no time. What? Green indicates open vents. Yellow indicates closed vents. Let me see. I choose with this pad. X selects oh, uh, circle button exits. I should be able to open and close the vents from here. If I open the right vent, Raz can proceed. Okay. Uh, I mean, that one doesn't seem to go anywhere. So Raz needs to go this way. Then this way, because then he'll end up up there. Oh, uh, because that, that doesn't look like it's attached. That looks like it's above the rest of the vent. Uh, can we, all oh, right. Oh. I mean, that works. We can just open all of them. Except the one that is trapped in here. I guess that kind of works. <clears throat> Alright. So we can't go back, but we can go forwards. Right, what's this way? Ah, but we can't. Oh, no, we can. I mean, cool, I guess. This is going to get probably a little bit confusing, but that's okay. All right, where does this go? There's a strong wind blowing ahead. Oh. And I need to turn down my headset, because that is deafening. Yeah. Should we go walk into it? I don't think I could make that jump. I have to find a way to stop this. I could get over there. You sure? You sure you don't want to jump? Could have been funny. Oh, Raz, he's just not a team player, dude. Could have been funny to see you, like, minced into thousands of pieces. But, you know, I guess you're just not a team player. Right, let's go. So, what's down this way, then? Oh, boy. Can we? Okay, I thought we could actually like pop our heads up there, but maybe not. Man. Oh God. The exhaust is too hot. Can't go any further without help. Ah. Uh, wait. Do we? Oh no. Do we have to go all the way back now? What's he doing? Why doesn't he keep going? Because he's stuck. That's why. Oh, I see. Oh. The turbo vent's damaged. But he should still be able to get clear. Of course. The turbo's reversed. He's getting blasted by the exhaust. I've got to close the valve, or he doesn't have a chance. Okay. Well, no time like the present, I suppose. Um... So yeah, I opened that valve and apparently we needed to close the valve. God damn it. Alright, well, at least Millie's strapped, so... She's got three bullets. I guess we're going to encounter a monster. 
Uh, shit. I wonder if we can find some more bullets for the gun. Don't forget, Millie, save the last bullet for yourself. Yeah, I'm guessing she can't just kick its ass. Because, you know, she's a weak woman. Uh, she's no Jill Valentine, or Ada Wong, or Claire Redfield. <clears throat> Even though she's wearing Claire's colours. See, Claire... Claire would bend that thing's spine like a balloon animal. That's if all the enemies are the same, of course. If they're all the same carbon-copied bloody uh, monster. Which I don't mind, you know. We don't have to have hunters and Mr. X is following us around. Ooh. Right, this is the only valve I can find. It must be the exhaust pipe. I have to close it. There we go. Alright, let's get out of here. Really? There's nothing going to attack us? I find that a little hard to believe. I mean, nothing's attacked us yet. I think we should, we should be. I don't know why I'm running all the way back with her, actually. Probably do need to manipulate those controls again. <clears throat> It'd kind of be a pain in the ass if we have to then open the vo uh, valve later on. Hoping this is just like a one backtrack deal. But, you know, this is a 1997 game of questionable quality. Is there actually anything else in that box whilst we keep walking past it? Isn't any, like, extra bullets because three seems suspect? Nothing, no. Stop pushing things, Millie. Come on. There we go. Okay. Right, let's have a little look. There's no need to use this right now. Okay, so I guess we've done everything that we need to. The exhaust has stopped. Excellent! There's a strong wind blowing ahead, so we've got that fucking valve thing going on. Oh no, okay. Oh shit. Uh, this is awkward. I guess emergency suspend. All right, well, fight through the pain, Raz. You know. Oh, I guess duck walking and crouch walking is the way. Curious. I mean, it seems a little bit silly that you'd have the suspend. Um, let's speed this up. You'd have the suspend panel <laughs> right in front of the fan that you need to suspend. But, I mean, I, you know, I didn't design it for this. So. Must, this must be an emergency switch. Did that shut the other one? Ah, it did. It shut the other one down as well. Shut all of them down. Okay. Well, I mean... Alright. That was fairly simple. Back into the vents, I suppose. Now... Messages to reply to. Okay. So the fans are now off. Fingers crossed. 
Oh god, can you imagine just doing this in real time? Ah, oh, emulation. Emulation is a godsend. It really is. Come on, baby. There we go. Yeah, that would be very monotonous to have to do that <laughs> without fast forwarding. Okay, cool. Right, now let's see what's through here. I guess we've got another, va uh, another vent. I mean, I, what did I expect? Come on, Metal Gear fucking solid. Right, uh, I should be behind the sterilization room. Okay, that wasn't actually too bad, to be fair. Probably would have taken six hours to do that without the fast forward button. Right, yeah, Solid Snake would have been proud with that. Ah, it looks like we've got a container or something here. Nothing here. Are you sure? Are you absolutely certain? You're not hiding anything from me? Because, ooh. Small canister. A small canister that we can't take, I guess. All right, let's get her back to where she needs to be. Get her sterilized. Although, sterilization doesn't really work like that. Surely you need to be wearing a clean suit. You can't have exposed skin. You, you, you can't sterilize skin. Not living skin. Hmm. <sighs> Because living skin is, you know, full of bacteria and microbes and whatnot. Which switch to start? Uh, why are you asking me? Not this one. <laughs> well, as long as you know. Ah, maybe this big, ominous, black-looking one. Ah. Uh, virus analyzing station. Insert cap. Ooh. A virus analyzing station. I could learn about the virus with this. Yeah. Yes, we could. Interesting. I guess that's like an optional thing. Or is it? Is there multiple endings? Virus analysis. Designation, Artificial Ribonucleic Acid, ARNA Virus. Properties, Retrovirus Incorporating Human RNA Proteins. ARNA Virus not shown in database. This is a new virus. Characteristics, Aggressively reorders DNA of infected organism, disrupting genetic code of host. Effects, Extreme increase in metabolism of infected organism transformation of tissue structures. Complete metamorphosis of host organism is ultimate result. Oof. No longer human. Interesting. Prognosis. Traumatic reordering of host cellular structure will result in total systemic collapse. Host organism will die. Projected mortality rate of infected subjects stands at 100% fatal. 100% fatal? Oh. I don't stand a chance. I'm a dead man. Oh dear. An artificial virus would make such a thing. Millie, is it too late for her too? I have no idea if it's too late but for if her. If a man created this virus, there must be a way for man to cure it. We must find a way for Millie's sake. Millie, can you hear me? Yes. Oh, thank goodness you're back. Are you all right, Millie? Millie, stay where you are. I'm going to get you decontaminated. Here goes nothing. Yeah, hopefully we don't just inject her with the virus. Sterilization sequence. 60 seconds to completion. I mean, it's possible. Oh, you've got the gun. Oh, fuck. Look at that. 
fucking thing. Use the gun. It's not working. It's, it's jammed. Oh. Millie, the safety's on. Release the safety, Millie. Shoot it. Seriously? <laughs> okay. I mean, sure. That's definitely. Whoa. Dude. The safety catches on. Oh, for crying out loud. Yeah, now she's just realized how stupid she's been. I got him, Raz. I stopped it. It's still alive. Forty seconds to completion of stabilization. How many times do I have to kill this damn thing? Well, you only had three bullets. Huh. Millie, get out while you can. No, I <laughs> won't leave you like this. Twenty seconds. It's too late for me. Save yourself. Shut up. When we go, we go together. Aww. Ten seconds to completion. All the time the zombies is killing. Oh, it's talking. Your name? No. Sterilization it couldn't be. Complete. You may now proceed. What? Go on, Millie. Get out of here while you can. She's just like, yeah, okay. What did it say? Feed? Uh. Um. Uh. Oh. She's just got a broken leg. Raz is dead, apparently. Somehow. Even though he just got tapped. The military's playing us for fools. We've got to shut down the project. Don't be absurd. This was supposed to be about enhancing longevity. Improving immunological defenses, but they've corrupted it. You're naive if you thought we could limit how our findings are applied. Sure, we may not like. Now who's being naive? Any good that might have come of this will never see the light of day. We're only helping them create their synthetic soldiers, mindless killers. It's a trade off. Think of the medical advantages. Think of the death. Don't be so overly dramatic. All we're doing is enhancing some natural genetic selections. It's as natural as cross-selecting these trees for strength and beauty. Beauty? How dare you talk of beauty? What we're doing is monstrous and deadly. If anything should happen to this facility... Nothing's going to happen. If the virus should escape into the environment, there's no telling what could happen. It could destroy all humanity. <laughs> Dramatic. So, there's no cure for the virus, then? So, they were trying to create super soldiers. Um... Okay. Hey there. You okay? I was worried about you. I'm okay. What's going to steam me in here? Where are we now? It's our... Looks like some sort of botanical garden. Trees. What's happening, Raz? Uh, no, Are don't touch right? me. It's the infection spreading. Trees. It's all right, I know. I remember trees. That's right. Just a little mold. <laughs> you, you're still safe from it, aren't you? Seems so. Good. Maybe the decontamination process worked for you. That must be it. Yeah, it must be. I'm glad. I hate to see this happen to you. And I hate to see you like this. We'll find a cure. You think so? 
Wish I could be so sure. You know, the writing is bad, because of course it is. But the voice work is competent. I, I kind of like this Raz fella. He's so down and miserable. He he speaks to me. Right. Oh, fuck me. We're on 30 minutes too. So we're in a new area. Um, what I don't understand is that first zombie thing that we came up against. We beat the fuck out of that and it died. Yet, Millie shot it three times with a 9mm gun. And it didn't die. So, fists more powerful than gun? Okay, cool. Also, we appear to be uh, scientists that were designing some super virus to advance and help mankind. But we got taken over by the military to turn it into some kind of military application to produce zombies yeah okay i'm on board i'm down with that that's that's very 90s video games i guess yeah that that makes sense but of course we both have explosive amnesia and can't remember what the hell's going on so we're not just some grunt. Uh, we, from what we've just heard, because that was hit, that was Raz's voice. We are indeed uh, some kind of scientist, as is Millie, I guess. Interesting. Interesting. Well, alrighty then. I'm gonna leave it here, guys. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, till next time.